What's going on? Today I'm going to show you how to get the best start in Outward. Let's get going. All right, you're going to wake up on the beach. Just start grabbing everything. You really don't need the torch. The torch doesn't really sell for anything. I grab it just for some light in the beginning. Get all the berries. Get your armor. Get all the seaweed. Go ahead and grab some water while you're running through it. Go ahead and grab your fishing harpoon. Go ahead and grab these berries here. Come back over here, grab these berries. Grab the berries over here. Now, basically, all that stuff you grabbed, go ahead and drop here. Run back over this way. Grab the machete. It's already in your hand. It's a weapon. Grab this pickaxe. They're going to come over here and kill these two dogs. Take everything. Kill the other dog. All right, if you get lucky, you'll get some predator bones. Loot this tree. Take it all. On your way out, grab these other berries. Grab the berries over here. You're trying to get some beetles. That's the main purpose of getting all these berries, but we're also going to make some stuff out of the berries and sell that too grab the more of the other seaweed right here more seaweed here now loot this the only th you don't really need the wood they sell it sells for nothing but everything else sells Pick up all the stuff you dropped here. Now you may have to switch some stuff out because it weighs too much. Like this, I can equip this. It's gonna be grab the bread over here. You don't really have to talk to this guy. Just get in a bedroll, sleep for one hour. All right, you're gonna wake up in your house. Go ahead and drop a couple things right here. Run downstairs, get your backpack. It automatically equips it. Go back upstairs. Pick everything back up, including the other stuff there on the table. Loot your stash. You're gonna have some more stuff. Again, the wood doesn't sell for anything, so you can just take the those two. Come on in here. Pick up the jerky, pick up everything, the gab berries. Go downstairs. Grab your lantern. There's going to be one an iron scrap here. Pick that up. And the flint and steel. Take your bedroll. Take your bread. Take your cooking recipe. And your gabberry jam. You can learn. You can either sell your recipe or learn it. I like to learn them all. Now use the kitchen. Make some gabberry tartines. You can make three of them, but also now you're going to make one more. Put berry in each one of these. Going to create gabberry jam, and then you'll be able to make another three more gabberry tartines. Run outside. Rise and Just shine. eat through all this. It does Enough. not matter what you, you heard, choose. <laughs> But with the always in the beginning like be this, it doesn't matter today. what you choose. Later on, there'll be some... There's choices that matter. Grab those gab berries. Run straight up this hill. More gab berries. 
grab this great X go inside go through here up the stairs and there'll be a uh, chest here loot this chest you always get different things take all sometimes you get kind of a okay hat to start off with but I always sell it regardless all right so now we're just gonna go ahead and sell everything Unequip a lot of this stuff. Go ahead and throw on some rags, whichever one you want. They sell for the le less. Is there something you need? Just for a little bit of armor. Now, basically, sell your Mercedes, sell your mining pick. You can just keep a couple. You need a couple bandages, at least one. So sell the beetle. Keep your predator bones. Sell all the seaweed. Sell the flint and steels. Uh, the great axe is up to you. You can keep it for fighting. It's not too bad. Fi sell the fishing harpoon. All this armor. Clothes. More armor. Um, the Gadberry, Gadberry Tartines. We got six of them. Sell for two each. Sell the mineral tea. Um, the iron scraps are easy to get. So you can go ahead and sell it. Sell the jerky for now. And we'll go with that. Look at that. We're getting 66. So we're almost at 100, but we still got more collecting. Let's go. Grab these gab berries. More gab berries. Grab this pitchfork. Grab these crab eyes. Crab eyes sell pretty decent, but you also have a chance to get a beetle out of those too. Go up here, grab this quest from her. Greetings, friend. I'm here about work. Lend me your ear. I'm looking for something to do nearby. Fact, I could if it pays good, number one. Is what I need. You'll and know then it sounds like an adventure. It. Number three. Perfect. Lend me your ear. She gives you two antidotes. Lend me your ear. And a quest. Leave there. Loot this junk pile. Grab everything. Go down here. Grab these gab berries. And more gab berries. You can come over here, grab this axe. Crab eyes. Over here, there's going to be another machete. Grab the machete. More crab eyes. Over here, grab this water skin. Go over here. Grab a, another fishing harpoon. Now... I'm going to grab these fish. And hopefully you'll get a chance. You'll either, you will either can get seaweed, you get fish, but hopefully you'll get uh, maybe a piece of shrimp or blue, blue sand. Sells really good. More fish. And more fish. Here we go. I got a shrimp and some boots. Loot this junk pile. Hey, I got some another fish and harpoon. All right, we're slowing down. Don't have too much more to loot but we're gonna go ahead and sell what we got i'm gonna take off this pitchfork so i can sell it anything that you currently have equipped will not show up to sell all right sell the machete i'm gonna keep the great axe sell the hatchet so at least one fish and harpoon always keep keep at least one fish and harpoon at this point so pitchfork armor armor boots look at that one shrimp is nine silver you got five crabs crab eye seeds one silver each sell the fish sell the beetle uh you can sell one antidote if you want i like to do that and confirm that we're at 162 silver go up here you got three recipes right here each recipe i think sells for three so you can either sell the recipes or use them so you know what more can I, do? Oh, I like to right. learn everything i can then sell them three each if you wanted so that would be nine silver but i like to learn them all now go back up here you're gonna get your first skill everybody should have this skill 
Amber, my friend. Curious. Amber, my friend. You're gonna get fitness. Increases your maximum health by 25 and the amount of health you restore while sleeping by 20%. Buy that for 50 silver. You still have 112 left. Now you're everybody's not gonna have the same amount of silver, but you should have around this. Run over to this lady. You're gonna get a better backpack. I'm gonna grab the nomad backpacks. 25 silver. Purchase. Gonna equip this backpack. It automatically you you'll have a you get a lantern later that it automatically hooks to unless you unless if you didn't already sell it. Pick this primitive satchel back up, take all, and then take all again. Move to pocket or move to backpack. Sorry, move to bag. And now your now your lantern's hanging off the back of your backpack there. Turn it on and off how you want. That doesn't take up a hand anymore. Talk to him. I want to sell something. something. Sell the old satchel. Nine silver. Now what we have left. I like to keep the dagger for my build. But if you want, you can easily. You take this dagger. Break it down. I had two daggers, so break them down. Is there and something then you need? you can sell that iron. Those iron scraps. So now one of the best things to do go to the front gate first now very important come and talk to this guy next don't go don't leave anywhere else don't go out the back door which is the storehouse don't do anything come to this talk guy next have the weapon on you that you want to use you could um with all the silver you have you can you should be able to buy a weapon a, or maybe ha keep the axe like I got so I'm gonna um, equip the axe whatever weapon is in your main hand is the skill you're gonna get a skill for talk Need to him something? I'm going outside well, you got the essentials he's gonna at least. teach you a skill Here, yes there you go he ta taught me execution skills is and gave me a flint and steel out the wild. now you can equip your skill wherever you want Now we're gonna run out the back door. And drink some water real quick. And use some get eat some gab berries. Get your stamina back faster. Alright, now you're in the storage room. I'm gonna go in here. You can get another lantern right here. You just sell for one each. Grab this bread. Recipe. Loot this junk pile. Take everything. Now, if you get a cooking pot, they weigh a lot. Well, they weigh three, but you can convert it to a helmet. A lot of people don't know that one. Now you got some decent um, resistance for a little while. Not very good if you uh, for weight though. Grab this pit mining pick. Now you got two guys to fight right here. You have one more over here somewhere. There he is. Go back and pick up your backpack. See what they have to loot. Usually they don't have much. I don't like to take the little stuff and take their weapons, the tridents. Now you're going to run this way, run out the back. You need at least one bandage on you. All right, now we're back outside. Grab the seaweed. You're going to make your way this way. Stay over here because sometimes there's a uh, big shrimp over there. Grab these fish. Grab this seaweed. If there's a shrimp, not if there's a shrimp around here, don't worry about this one, but grab this seaweed if you can. Unless you're pretty good, you're not ready to fight these shrimp over here. I'll show you what the shrimp is. That right there. 
and he does lightning attacks so you don't really want to mess with him come around this side and kind of hide behind this rock talk to this guy you're gonna give him number you're gonna choose number two move. give him a bandage he's gonna give you a writ of tribal favor ow i don't think i'm fit to run back home just yet now if you can you can grab this blue sand right here you can barely see it but there's blue sand there all right now we're running back to town unfortunately we have to go through the back way or go around so just follow my way kill all these birds if you can most of the time they run away later on you'll be able to kill them really fast what you're trying for is their helmet they they have a very low chance of dropping a uh a bird helmet that gives you I think it's like plus 15 or plus 20 run speed very nice grab these gab berries loot this trunk over here take all drink some more water get your stamina coming back faster again go ahead and kill this dog unfortunately he doesn't have any of the um we're looking for the predator bones that's what we need off them and upgrade your weapon with those oh we got two more dogs here now they are kind of hard to fight especially when there's two of them and you can get poisoned by them so you got to be careful Pick up your backpack. Loot them. Still no predator bones. We're really hoping for predator bones to upgrade our weapon. Run back this way. Always stay to the left side. Come over here. There's going to be a chest to loot. Loot this chest. Power coil. That sells nicely. You get a power coil, you're... You got lucky. Keep running this way. Now you're going to make your way over to this way. Your town is right there. But you're going to come over here first. There's a tree trunk right over here to grab. And loot this tree trunk. I get some nice stuff off of it. Another recipe you can sell or use. Again, I like to use all mine. And the ones left, then I'll sell them. Now you're going to make your way up here. Give me one more chest to sell. Uh, loot. There's bandits over here, so watch out for them. Unless you want to fight them and knock them out, but... Loot whatever they have, but... We're not ready yet. Go ahead and loot this. Take anything that's in there. Now on our way back to town, we'll grab more gab berries. All right, now that we're back in town, we're going to go ahead and sell. Sell the weapons you got off those guys in the cave. Sell the armors. Sell one of the fishing harpoons if you got two again. Um, you want at least one mining pick, so keep that. Sell anything extra. Okay, no, sorry. The power coil was 20. Either way, 20 is nice. Blue sand, 14. Sell all the seaweeds. The incendiary charges. You need at least one flint and steel, so always keep one on you, but you, you'll never need more than that. Sell the fish. Oil bomb. You can keep that or sell it. I'm going to sell it. So sell anything you don't need. You don't need two lanterns. Unless you want to use one, you have a skill to throw them. I'm going to sell it. So now you're at 195. I'm at 195 silver. All right. So now we're going to take our writ. Am I over? Yeah, I'm over encumbered. Uh, move this to the backpack. Move this to the backpack there. Now I can run at full speed again. 
go turn in your writ of tribal favor at this point she is going to be up here waiting for you Again, Greetings. Doesn't, uh, choose number efforts. one. You have a way to make that I earned a tribal Show favor, me. number two. And, on time and then oh, after yeah. that, just hit Come whatever you want. Once you've said your goodbyes to them. Again, these ones don't matter what you say. It's all going to be the same. Talk to this guy. You're basically saying goodbye to him. He's leaving. Now the other person leaving that you got to talk to is right here. Talk to her. And now the guy that you just talked to on the beach, his brother's going to be back here. Go talk to him. You're going to choose number two first. Hmm. Number one. Oh no. Oh number no. two. Oh no. Hmm. Hey, listen. And he's going to give you two life potions, one antidote, and one hex cleaner. Now we're going to go back inside our our tent, our house, sorry. So now your house, you own it now. You don't no longer own the you no longer owe the tribe any money, so you won't lose it. Go back downstairs. Right here. Now you can make some gabberry jams with all the gabberries you picked up. Turn that into the gabberry tartines. And then you can make some meat stews if you have the stuff for it. Now, some of that you can sell and some of that you can keep. That's all on you. And now with the money you have left over, at this point, I'm at 195. I can gain some more. I can sell. I can break this down and sell it. Um, I could sell some of these tartines, maybe the meat stew. I can't remember if it sells, but another one of these. Keep the life potions. Can uh, cook some of this meat and sell it. Uh, sell some of these hides. Sell a couple bandages. But I'm at basically 200 silver. So that right there is how you get the best outward start you can get. Really, um, just grab everything and sell it. And now you can go and buy some more gear buy a better weapon buy anything you want and then you go to the first cave uh which is out and to the left let me go and show you where that is real quick now you're gonna run up here and you're just gonna follow these mountains here This is really where you should be going next. After you get your good weapon, after you've done all the stuff I've shown you, and you've got gear and you got some food, you got some water, go this way. All right, and the cave is right over here. Go in here and clear this cave and You'll be good to go. So to me, that is the best start you can have an outward. You get you start off with good bit of silver. You start off with a quest. You start off with somewhere to go. You can buy gear. You get your first skills. And then you just go out in the world. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Make a comment down below. Let me know what you liked, what you didn't like. Maybe something I missed. Let me know. Have a good one.